back to my channel it's jasmine here as you can tell by the title of the video i'm going to be doing a dollar tree christmas haul and i am so excited it's been forever since i've done a haul um yeah because honestly it is really hard to try and get these like sit down videos done uh with my kids being home uh doing virtual learning uh it's just so much noise and distractions it's just like a lot going on during the day so excuse me y'all but yeah i'm up early today um and i am ready to show y'all what i got i hope everybody's doing good uh comment down below and let me know how you doing how's everybody doing especially during like all these crazy times right now how are you guys doing um we're doing good over here thank god you know, can't complain. We're getting through. We're just, we're doing okay. Um, so let me show y'all what I got. Okay. Um, now I have been picking up things like over the last two weeks or so, maybe more, because my Dollar Trees started putting out Christmas like before Halloween even came through. Okay, so I've been um i have been picking up things here and there uh there were a few like hot ticket items that are out this year that i really wanted to get my hands on so yes i did get those were was able to get some of those things that i wanted um and then there were some things that i haven't seen anybody posting on instagram or youtube that i did find that i think you should really really look out for um yeah, so the first thing that I love and I definitely think you should pick up if you can find them are these gift boxes, okay? So they have the gingerbread, they have a gingerbread one. I believe they had a penguin one, but I didn't get that. Uh, but they had the gingerbread houses. They come in two sizes. So I got a larger one and a small one. Okay, and this is how it looks around okay super cute and then it opens on the top because it is a gift box okay and then i also got this kind of like snowman shop i mean snowman sorry santa shop or santa's house um yeah so i guess it's supposed to be the north pole because it says welcome to the north pole so i got this one Look how cute those reindeer are. And there's a little penguin. <laughs> okay. And it has a little sleigh with presents. So I got the larger one for this one <laughs> and also a small one. Okay. So I love these. Y'all look out for these. I'm going to actually be using these for decor uh, and not gift boxes, but. Um, even if you were to give somebody a gift in one of these, I think that would be really cute. And they can keep, it's a nice like little keepsake for after. Uh, you, you know, you can use this for storage. Um, they could even use it as decor. So definitely look out for these. And then I also got some more. I thought these were gorgeous, 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 gorgeous boxes. I love the little candy cane stripe ribbon or a string on top check that out opens like that and then I also got this like cylinder one and I just love the, the design on it the colors really really cool okay and then the last one I want to show you is this mailbox yes this is a gift box as well it says it on the bottom oh my goodness look at that it says jolly on the bottom but yeah this is also a gift box in the shape of a mailbox this is how it looks and this i'm going to be using as decor as well but again as a gift box imagine getting a gift like in a mailbox this is so cute but definitely look out for these guys um at your dollar tree so the next thing that i want to show you are the florals that i picked up now normally i get like a lot of florals um i love florals 
and I love signs like I don't know why but I feel like florals and signs are like the easiest and quickest way to like change out your decor and I'm constantly like swapping things out during the holidays and seasons and those transition uh, transition periods so I think that's why I love them so much and they're just like great space fillers and yeah so the ones that I got, I didn't get much. I was specifically going there for certain colors. Um, <clears throat> but I already have so many, like, Christmas florals. I really just wasn't trying to go overboard. But I did find a couple of florals and picks that did stand out to me. And this is one of them. Look how pretty that is. It's like a glittery silver branch. Okay, and I got two of them. I'm doing like a winter wonderland theme in my dining room. So I thought these would look really pretty. Uh, yeah, in there. And then I also got these gold poinsettias. Look how pretty those are. I love this like the leaves here. See how that looks? I love that. And then lastly, uh, for picks are these gold and glittery berries. And to me, I feel like their florals uh, this year are a lot better quality. Uh, so kudos to you, Dollar Tree, for that. I mean, there's still glitter coming off, but it's not like just, like, you know, I can shake it and it's like hardly anything coming off at all, so... Shout out to Dollar Tree for stepping it up with their florals. Okay, so the next thing in kind of like florals um, are these bottle brush Christmas trees. So I got them in gold, green, and also in silver. Oh my goodness, these are gorgeous. I love these trees. So I went ahead and picked up some of these. And I believe they also had them in red. Yeah, they had red. I can't remember if they had white. Uh, and I think I remember seeing blue. I'm not sure. Um, but yeah, definitely look out for these beauties at Dollar Tree. Because I know these are probably going like super quick. Okay, so then also, um, since, you know, kind of goes with florals, um, usually the ribbon is next to the florals, uh, but yeah, I'll just go into ribbons. Um, so I found this beautiful red and black buffalo uh, plaid ribbon. It is nine feet of ribbon. Okay, so I got that one. And then I also got this farmhouse ribbon that I love. This is probably like my favorite ribbon at Dollar Tree um so when I see it I just get it because it goes like that so uh this is also nine feet but it's on the thinner side and it's kind of like a off-white and uh like faded black and it just says farmhouse ribbon on it <clears throat> um and then also I got these beautiful gold candles now they are unscented uh, it's a two pack and this one is in gold they also have red and green uh yeah but i got the gold look at that and i love candles they don't have a scent but that's okay um that is okay okay y'all and there was one more thing in greenery and picks that i forgot to show you that this i don't know how i missed it but this is probably uh, aside from the the bottle brush trees um yeah this was probably one of my favorite finds um because i did not see these last year um either they are pine picks so it's a pack of six and they are flopped they are flopped pine picks um and this is how they look let me tell you, the quality is really good. The snow is not like falling off. They're really thick, really sturdy. Um, the wire is bendable. 
so uh you know you can make like a nice garland with these which i only got two packs and i think i'm going to not think i'm going to go back and hopefully i can find more of these because i think i'm going to make like a nice garland with these um from one of my mantles uh but yeah this is how they look and like i said really good quality um i originally got them to make like little mini trees like i was gonna put them together like this and make my little my own little christmas trees or little pine trees um for my kitchen like something like that you know i'd arrange it and then maybe put some burlap like get some foam some floral foam and then wrap it in burlap like those cute trees they have at target right now so anyway definitely definitely look for these okay so the next thing that i want to get into are the signs that i picked up this year so like i said i really did not go crazy with signs and things like that this year i already have so many signs so i just picked up a couple um as you can see i'm really loving the snowman this year um this is one of my themes and one of the rooms in my house so first one is this little cutie right here it's like a little standing block sign um that says season's greetings and then next is this little hanging guy here that says let it snow okay and I, this one i think i'm gonna be using for a wreath but i'm not sure yet and then lastly in my little snowman collection here is this let it snow sign it also says let it snow um i'm not really sure of the size of this but you know it's one of the long the tall signs that dollar tree puts out so those are the snowman signs so moving on to the other signs that i got um i got this big red merry christmas sign and then i also got this one that says season's greetings i love that it has the little holly and the berries oops on the top bottom in the side there and then I also got this big gold glittery bow isn't that pretty and I believe it's kind of like a burlap yeah it's like a burlap on top of like plastic but I love that the gold is in kind of subtle like it's really really pretty And next, as far as like signs and like hangings and things like that, I got these super cute window clings. Um, now they had a few, they had maybe like uh, six other, um, in total, they maybe had six different styles. Um, so I just got these um, because I'm kind of going for like a gingerbread theme in my kitchen. So I just went ahead and picked up these. And I just love how these look. Um, so I got this one. It has all the Christmas treats on it. Now I plan to make like signs, like little signs uh, for my kitchen with these. But I love these. These are so adorable. And then I also got this one that has the little gingerbread houses on it says happy holidays you could even make a sign with this and the snowflakes or even the candy canes but i love 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 these so many options uh with these guys and it's so easy like all you need to do is like maybe get some scrapbook paper or cardstock as your like background and um you can just choose <laughs> you can put together your own little signs and you get 19 pieces for a dollar this one right here is my favorite i actually ended up getting two of them because i really really love this one i just love that it kind of has that vintage look but look how cute that is this can go like in a cocoa bar or a coffee bar uh, in your kitchen but 
love 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 these and these are this one is 12 pieces for a dollar like i said this one was 19 and this one was 15 so i guess it just depends on which one you get and how many pieces you get but it's still a lot of options for just a dollar Okay, y'all so this is another one of my favorite finds this is a one of those hot ticket items that everybody is loving right now um i believe they had about including this one they had three other mats but i think everyone loves this one here because it looks the most high end um and just the theme of it you know it's not all cartoony or anything like that so and i love the color I cannot wait to put this down uh, for Christmas and it is a little thin but um, you know you can put like another mat or rug under it Dollar Tree does carry those as well so definitely look out for this okay so the next thing I found that I have no clue what I'm supposed to use this for but I do know what I'm going to be using it for I'm actually gonna be making some little mini christmas trees um so it says it's a collapsible wreath stand and comment down below if you know what these are actually used for because i have no clue and okay so this is how it looks when it's propped up um so i think if you cover this with some garland um or some pine picks or whatever uh, i think this would make um like a great little mock Christmas tree. At least that's what I plan on doing with this, with mine. I'm gonna figure out some way to make it look like a Christmas tree. Okay, y'all, so moving on to like ornaments and lights and things like that. So my favorite ornaments that I picked up are, starting with these beautiful snowflakes right here. Oh my goodness. Aren't these beautiful? And it kind of like, this spins. But again, like I was saying, like along with their florals, like their ornaments, a lot of their ornaments are really, really well made this year. So I ended up getting two of these. Okay, so like I was saying, I picked up these little sleds right here. I have one in red and then I got another one in silver. Well, aren't these cute? Has the little pine cone and the bow with the pine. Okay, so next I found these gold horns. And I'm gonna think I'm gonna actually go back and get some of these for my Christmas tree as well. I think they fit my theme really nicely. Aren't these cute? And again, no glitter, just dropping off of it. Love, love, love these. Okay, so the next one that I'll show you guys are these right here. Got some more snowflakes. Okay, I don't know if you can see like the glitter on them. Okay, and I got two packs of these. Again, these are for DIY, specifically for DIY, so that's why you only see me with a couple. Okay, so anyway, um, and then the next one that I really, really love is this gold church. Now, they did have these last year, but um, I just didn't have a need for it last year, but this year I plan to use this uh, on a wreath that I have in mind. Isn't that beautiful? Okay, and then the next one are these five pack of silver snowflakes, silver glitter snow uh, snowflakes. So got those, and they do come with a little string to hang them. And then last for ornaments are these little mini. Um, bowl ornaments i got one in gold and then i also got one in red and that is it for ornaments now i'll move on to some of the christmas lights that i got now 
um i only got one pack because i'm I've, i don't think i've ever bought like actual christmas lights at dollar tree I, I love their fairy lights but i'm not so sure about the christmas lights so i went ahead and got uh this pack right here it's um five feet of 20 lights for a dollar so um you know it's pretty small but um I'm kind of going for, like I said, that gingerbread theme in my kitchen. So I want it to be colorful in my kitchen. So this amount of lights would be perfect for like my windowsill, like maybe to wrap around it or put on the windowsill. So um, in the next clip, I will show you how these look lit up. See, it's just enough for like a small little space. So I think these will look nice in my kitchen. So I'm going to test them out. In the next clip and i'll show you how they look and then the second pair of lights that i got that i haven't seen before at least they're new to me are these led uh lights so they are battery operated lights kind of like the fairy lights um they're led it's 10 lights and they are the colorful ones so this is how it looks and it has the battery pack too it takes two um it's three feet and it takes two double a batteries so again i will show you in the next clip how both of these look okay guys so here are the lights the colored lights um all plugged in these are the plug-in lights so i really love the color they don't even the camera doesn't even do it justice to be honest but the colors are really bright and vibrant so it's definitely worth uh, the buy okay so here are the LED lights the LED color lights. so the light is actually white in these um, and it's not really it's a very very uh, dull light y'all I guess because it's LED so it's still pretty uh, but it's not like a bright, bright light. But this is how they look all lit up. All right, guys. So moving on, um, I also picked up some of this uh, fake snow here. Now this one has like the iridescent flakes inside of it. Hopefully you can see it. And this is by Crafted Square. Definitely look out for that. And then I got one of the iridescent looking mini trees. I love these Dollar Tree mini trees. So this year, um, I have a lot of the green ones, but um, this was another hot ticket item. Everybody's getting these. So I went ahead and just got one. Um, I was thinking of giving it to my daughter or putting it in my kitchen so i actually might go back and get more get one or two more so that my daughter can have one and then i can put one of these in one or two of these in my kitchen um yeah so aren't isn't this pretty like this is so well made like honestly but look how beautiful that is like look at the color i love this so yeah definitely look out for these last thing as far as like ornaments and decorations are these little nutcrackers and they have a bunch of color combos um but i chose these two because one of my color themes does have green and gold in it so yeah that is it as far as ornaments and decorations and things like that okay so the next thing are i guess the kind of like treats and sweets um dollar tree has tons of candy tons of treats and sweets and things like that so um i went ahead and picked these up um i actually saw one other youtuber post about these and how they were really good she said that yeah these were really good so i want to give them a try it's actually um well i've noticed that um they were like the packs were different so i'm not sure oh no it says the same thing so the basically the chocolates are peanut butter filled and it comes with uh the little chocolates here and it has pretzels 
and also some peanuts so um yeah if you love peanuts and chocolate and kind of like that sweet and salty um check these out and actually i'm gonna give it a try you wanna try some too my daughter's here we're gonna try them so let me see if i can open it hold on guys okay so i'm gonna cut this open like this and let's give it a try so i got a chocolate i want a chocolate <laughs> Oh, it kind of smells like um, like peanut Reese's butter. peanut butter cup. Mmm. Mm. Um, you want one in there? I can't no one. Why not? We're taking a brain break. Yeah. Mm. Um. Oh yeah. So mm, the two is the chocolate is filled with peanut butter, and it tastes like exactly like Reese's peanut butter cup. Like honestly, y'all. I'm not a fan of buying like chocolates and things from Dollar Tree because to me they always yeah I'm not a fan of Dollar Tree like food and um like candy and stuff because I feel like it's always like stale and old but this is actually good so I'm gonna take some pretzels and a peanut and then I'm gonna put some chocolate with it and see how it tastes together Yeah, um, I really like that sweet and salty taste. These are really good. And the chocolate is actually really good too. So definitely check these out. It is actually the uh, Rudolph Snack Mix. Um, and it's by Palmer's Chocolate. Um, so I've never really had Palmer's Chocolate. So definitely look for these when you go to Dollar Tree because it really is good. If you like chocolate... And peanut butter these are really good all right okay so the next thing i wanted to show you guys are the cups that i got from dollar tree so i will start with the tumbler um now i got two tumblers uh this one has the little uh you slide it open to open it but this is how this one looks. It says let it snow and it has the green and gold and white uh, color. Very sturdy, very good quality. These will also be great for gifts. I actually think these are going to be my Christmas gifts to everyone this year. Um, and I may stuff little things inside the cups. But that one. And then I also got this hot cocoa uh or coffee or tea i'm not really a coffee drinker but i will definitely use this for some tea and hot cocoa on the go but this is it also says let it snow and it has like the hot cup of coffee and cocoa there and then the whipped cream cup really really cute and it also has the hand grip right here and this one is probably my favorite out of all the tumblers. Um, this one here, which I have not seen anyone post this one, uh, it's just a drink. It has a straw uh, tumbler here. So it says Slay Vibes, Best Christmas Ever, Get Your Festive On. It has just all these cute, um, cool <laughs> sayings. I love the the hashtag there that says santa goals express your elf um yeah so yeah i thought this was really cute and i actually think i'm gonna go back and get some more for my kids um because these will be great cups for like around the house but definitely check those out and also as a gift as well all right and then moving on to the mugs so i love this one I was saying um here's one of the mugs that i got so this one was my favorite out of i think three other ones um it says naughty nice and i tried i love 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 this one and then the next one i got that i just happened to find uh the plate to match was this baking spirits bright a uh, little set right here so i got the plate and then I also got me the mug. Oh, 
Okay, so now I'm going to get into my crafts. And last but not least, so the first thing I got were these um, wood cutouts here. So it comes with six pieces for a dollar. Uh, it's two of each of these. Um, and I mainly got it for the stars. Um, but these, I guess these flowers uh, cutouts right here, they can also um, serve as little gingerbread people. So I think that's what I'm going to use this for. Um, yeah, so, and then Valentine's Day will be coming up soon after, uh, you know, the holidays and everything. So definitely look out for these. All right, and then the next... Um, wood uh craft that i got was this uh cross right here okay so it's a wood hanging decor now mind you all these things are from the crafted squares uh section so love love that i love that it's thick and chunky and i cannot wait to diy this um okay so the next thing i got was this merry and bright sign i just love that saying merry and bright so i got this and then i also got two of these wooden stars and i actually plan to make uh, my tree topper this year for my tree so that's why i got these two babies right here but I love, love, love these. And then I went ahead and picked up these two gingerbread men. Aren't they cute? They have the little buttons and the sleeves and the bow ties. So definitely can't wait to DIY these. I'm probably going to let my kids paint these um, and put these in my kitchen. And then the last one that I got is this little cute snowman right here. Don't ask me why I only got one when I'm doing a snowman theme uh, in one of the rooms. But isn't it cute? I love that. The little scarf and the hat. Just adorable. Okay, so that's it for all of my wood signs and wood crafts. Um, and just a few other things that I picked up. Um, I went ahead and picked up some of the sponge brushes now. Um, they do have the sponge brushes in the crafters square aisle, but, um, I believe if you look in, cause I got this in the, um, the tool section, the hardware section. Um, yeah. So this, you know, Dollar Tree carries this brand right here in the tool section is called tool bench. Uh, tool bench so this pack of the actual part in the hardware aisle the tool aisle um, comes in a pack of eight now I do not know if the crafter square one comes with this many but yeah definitely check out the tool area the hardware section at Dollar Tree and check out this sponge brushes because it's the same brushes y'all and they actually might be a little bit thicker because I'm sure these would be used to do like, um, you know, repairs or something like that in the house. So definitely check out that and look for these. And then last but not least is my favorite, favorite find and crafts. And I got me a glue gun, y'all. Um, Dollar Tree sells glue guns now. They are really like Crafted Sections, I'm sorry, Crafted Square is really like, they're bringing out some really um, good stuff. So I had seen this floating around on um, Instagram, so I definitely went ahead and picked one up. I am in desperate need of a new blue line, y'all. So yeah, um, and I don't know why I never remember to actually buy a glue gun from Walmart because they were like three dollars three four dollars um there really is really not that expensive to just get a regular size glue gun but i just always forget um but it is about time to get me a glue gun because my old one is like i've had it forever and it's like smoking and yeah all that so 
yeah, it comes with two little glue sticks. Yeah, two little short, literally little glue sticks. Um, and yeah, I'm really excited to give this a try and test it out. That's how it looks, and it's pretty, pretty um sturdy. It's like decent quality, so definitely check out your Dollar Tree for a glue gun. Um, and that is it, y'all. That is everything that I have to show you all. Uh, for my Dollar Tree Christmas haul this year. I hope you all enjoyed this video. Um, and I hope that if you saw anything you like, you're able to still find it. It's still early, y'all. It's still early. They're still putting out things. So I hope you're able to find some of these things. But until the next time, bye.